Fast. I couldn't tell which direction they was coming from. I mean, I seen this one coming out right here, so I spun around this way. The green was coming out over this way. That was pretty neat, though. Yeah. <laughs> That's some fast howling action right there. I think the camera's got three minutes on it. <clears throat> and that's total length of the hunt. We come in here, walked across walk to the back side of this field so the wind would be blowing out in the field once we got set up. Jerry howled. What howler was you using? The two reed pup howler. Howled on the two reed pup howler. They answered. I heard them answering before he got through howling. Right behind us. We jumped up, spun around to face the direction they were going to come from. And by the time we got the five seconds it took us to spin around, we could hear them in the leaves coming, and we had coats popping out on both sides. I don't know how many I got on film. There were six coats total. All of them came out together, some on each side of us. And uh, the way we had to spin around, we were wanting the coats to come out of this block of timber. Instead, they come from a little old drain behind us. Had the wind blowing good. It was blowing out in the field. But our setup, where the coach were being directly behind us, that messed us up. Because for me to film, I had to set in the edge of the field. So as soon as they were popping out at 30, 40, 50 yards, we had one right here at about 20 steps. As soon as they would pop out, they would see me with the camera and run. So action-packed hunt, kind of a screwed-up setup because of where the coach were at. But... Uh, <laughs> Jerry tried a running shot on one. Didn't work out too good. He's uh he's hunting with a borrowed gun this morning. He got Kerry Wayne's gun and he's putting the bad luck on it. Jerry brings bad luck, seems like. I think we've looked at I don't even know now. Six coats already this morning. This is the second stand. We looked at six coats on this stand. 
six we yesterday. We put eyes on six coyotes yesterday. So 12 coyotes in two days. Jerry's got one on the ground. <laughs> I'm just running the camera, folks. I'm just running the camera. It's let's, go get, let's go get another one. It's MFK time. we got to make your luck change. <laughs> Ain't no doubt. Hard to beat that. Howdy in four. I hope we got it all on film. I don't know how many of them you could see. That one was in the lead a little ways. Jerry howled a couple times, what, 30 seconds, a minute? Wasn't long. You could hear them coming down this opposite reed. <coughs> Come in across the creek on nothing but howls. What is that? 30 yards? Jerry killed the first one. MFK, two reed pup howler. It was all Can't they could stand. It. All they could stand. Pop it with Kerry Wayne's gun. Yep. Jerry, Jerry's pro staff out of Alabama. He's up <coughs> hunting with us in Arkansas. Coat season just come in here. And they've been coming in good and strong to the howls. I don't know how many we've called up in the past couple of weeks, but it's been a bunch. And uh, a lot of them are coming in on just howls, howls and pup distress, but a lot of them show up on just the howls. This is definitely a lot different than I'm used to. <laughs> well, <clears throat> representing in my Scurry Outdoor World Predator Expo shirt. <laughs> 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 it was all the camouflage we needed this morning. 30 yards. Well, we got a little drag back out to the truck, and I think we're going to try to make another stand. Wind's blowing a little bit this morning. but uh, Ain't no weed. Jerry's got a drag. <laughs> yeah, Jerry will do I the will drag. finally broke the curse. I'll be gladly towed it out of here. Kerry Wayne's on the camera. I guess he's going to tow it out and get out of the dragon. <laughs> I'll lead the way, blaze the trail. Go get another one.